The reason to use a warm underpainting in such a cool monochromatic painting like this would be to help have some temperature contrast so where the paint gets a little leaner. Uh, you can start to see some of that warmth shine through and it doesn't stay overly consistent. Another interesting aspect is I think the palette seems to be broken down between you know, like an ultramarine blue which has a little bit of violet undertones and then the violet could be a dioxin purple or a alizarin crimson. Because the cooler palette tends to have a little less movement to it, it tends to sometimes lend itself to more of a somber or quiet space. Um, she seems to be introspective and in an action, sort of in a standard genre painting, similar to what you'd see in Dutch painting. It's a good way to relate the figure into the space where the cloth becomes another area or interim space between the sort of really cool gray background and floor and the figure. She also kind of relates the blue of her gown to the blue of the floorboard in the background, which is actually more intense and that kind of competes visually with the space, um, kind of linking her closer to the area of action with the flower pot.